Hello, Victor. This is Mike Fortner, just looking over your post here. Uh, one of the phrases that we used, we the instructors used incorrectly in working working out some things in these discussion posts, was uh, we talked about visible visible light spectrum versus radio telescopes. Not all optical telescopes are visible. The new one that's up there making all kinds of waves right now in space, the James Webb Space Telescope is uh, uh, primarily, I believe, an infrared telescope. Um, so it's, it's radiation that we cannot see actively with our eyes, but it certainly brings a lot of information to us. Now, one of the things that I'm interested in, and I'm just seeing what you think about this, since we, we can take uh, radiation from radio telescopes and in some manner form images with it, and I, and I believe what you've got depicted here in your field of radio telescopes uh, is uh, where we take the images, pardon, not, but not the images, the information, and run that through a computer in different ways and, and come out with, I'm going to say false color because it's false. It's not the real color that exists, but it's a color that's visible to our eyes so we can see it. Uh, and so that's what these images here are, I believe. Um, and you can tell the, the obvious detail and structure of these, these different colors. Um, but at any rate, uh, I believe that's what you're talking about. Uh, if you have any, uh, any issues with what I've, what I've said here in mind, please give me a response to this.